What's up guys? I'm Jay. Welcome back or welcome if you're new to my channel. Today I am joined with my dog Shadow. I'm petting her butt because that's literally her favorite thing on earth is getting her booty pet. So that's what we're doing. She's currently like making my blanket I brought out here all snowy. But I'm having a snow smoke sesh. We had an absolute like blizzard here just last week, a couple days ago. I'm really excited to film the snow sesh because I've never filmed a video like this like at all. But also it is fucking freezing outside. It blizzarded here yesterday. It's supposed to blizzard again in a couple days. So, you know, I'm here. I'm in my full snowboard gear, except for my gloves. Like I really honestly need those right now. It's fucking cold out here. Now that I'm here, I'm freezing. I forgot my hot chocolate. I need to go get that. I'm gonna go grab that and then we're gonna spark this up. This I got from the Stony Babe box. It's like a designer joint cone. It's got like a pink foil tip and then little weed leaves on the paper and it's so cute. So I'm really excited. I'm gonna go grab my hot chocolate. I think I'm gonna need that. Oh, that's so nice. I hope you guys can see everything okay. Um, there's definitely gonna be some like sun glares because the sun is out. It is just not very warm. It is super hard to light things out here because wind is coming from every direction and I have nothing to block it with, but I'm gonna give it my best shot with y'all. Yesterday, I literally dropped my lighter in the snow while trying to take a bong rip. It was so sad. The crazy thing to me about lighters is most of the time, after you drop them in like water or snow, they'll like dry out and they're fine. I don't know why that's like crazy to me, but I always feel like they're gonna be ruined, but they're not. So far so good. Let me know how the weather has been where you guys are at. Like I said, it's been blizzarding here. I literally only have one pine tree on my property and it's this one. And I think it's so pretty like when it snows. Like look at this man. Oh shit, another lighter to the snow. This joint is burning super nice. This is honestly so peaceful. I haven't smoked outside or like just filmed a video smoking outside in so long. I remember last year which was like the start of my channel around this time last year. I filmed like everything outside. Like I would come and stick it out in the cold. I have so much new content coming out for you guys on YouTube and Instagram super soon. Um, this is the first video that I filmed since my Instagram account got deactivated. This is the first video I'm filming like in real time since this happened. My post from July or June, I can't even remember, broke community guidelines and they notified me of that like February 13th. I didn't think much of it. That's the first time anything of mine had broken community guidelines and the next morning I woke up to my Instagram deactivated, which really sucked. It's still deactivated guys, so go follow jblaze2.0 if you don't. I don't know exactly what I'm doing Instagram wise yet, I'll figure that out and let you know if I decide to make another account or maybe I'll get my account back, fingers crossed. I've pretty much seen everybody in the cannabis community's account get deleted and brought back through this last like six months, so hoping for the best, positive vibes, you know. I'm trying to stay positive, it is difficult, I've been filling out appeal forms every day. But yes, jblaze2.0 is me, so you can go follow it. I will be posting some content on there soon. My joint is almost gone. It is smoked amazingly this entire time. Went out once because I was rambling about my account getting deactivated, but that's just a part of being in the cannabis community, as unfortunate as it is. Even if everything you're participating in is legal in your state or you're a medical card holder, your shit will still get flagged or taken down. 
you'll get strikes for it like whatever i feel like i'm in such a weird mood today i don't even know like what mood i'm in it's just different my joint's gone i'm going in shadow what are you doing are you eating the snow she has a fucking snowball in her mouth guys I'm currently puffing on this Gobi from E Nails. It rips so good and your dabs taste amazing out of it. Honestly, the coils in this thing, I've never seen anything like it. They're regular coils in a sense that they go like, you know, like this. There's just two of them in there like that. But they're wrapped around quartz, which I've never seen that. And it's so intriguing to me and it tastes so good. So, cheers. There's also an attachment that's called like a U-joint, I'm pretty sure, and it's like an upside down banger and it allows you to put this in there and then hit it through a water pipe, which is super cool. But I'm going to be smoking on this while we open the weed box. Let's get it. I'm so excited. They always send you a sticker and then this little business card that says you can win a free box and tells you how to enter that little raffle. And then there's their little sticker with their logo on it. So cute. Here's a little overview of what's going on in there. I'm gonna try and make this kind of quick because I feel like this video is already gonna be pretty long. The first thing I'm pulling out of here are these Huff socks. I have so many pairs of these. I really like these socks in general, but the pot leaves on them are so cute. I actually wore a pair earlier today, so. The next thing I'm seeing are these raw joint cones. This is just a three pack of cones these are super good for on the go or if you just suck it rolling um these are super quick and easy you just pack your weed into there and then twist off the top and you're good to go these look so cool these are twisted hemp hemp wraps it says there are four of them and it just says sweet so i guess the flavor is sweet i don't know but it sounds good the next thing i'm seeing are some mini king palms there are two of them in here and these are the terpene infused ones so these are the flavored ones i actually filmed a video trying the flavored king palms and i couldn't get them to pop and i've been wanting to pick up another pack of them so i could try it again so this is perfect um it says yeah squeeze and pop and this one is in the flavor these are in the flavor fruit passion i couldn't find it but it's right under the word king palm this is so perfect i cannot wait to try these i'm actually gonna like get them to pop this time you guys the next thing i see are some zigzags these are six cones so let's see oh i really like that i was not expecting that at all like a little matchbox you know slides in slides out this is so cute i've used zigzag papers in the past but i've never used the cones so this is interesting i like them like I said, I really like the box. Ooh, I am so excited. These are some flavored Juicy J's. It says milk chocolate flavored papers. I love flavored joint papers, specifically Juicy J's. They are some of my favorites. Oh, it does smell like chocolate. That's crazy. Here's what the paper looks like. I wish you guys could like smell it through the camera. Honestly, I'm surprised we don't have like scent cameras yet where you can like smell things through the camera. That'd be pretty fucking crazy, but... I feel like I've been thinking about that for years. Then I've got some blueberry primal wraps. I think I have another pack of these actually. I haven't tried them yet. I've got a lot of hemp wraps I need to get around to trying, but these look super good. They also match my nails. <laughs> We've got this clipper lighter. I always try and get the sticker off, but I suck at getting stickers off. This lighter is actually super cool. It's red, yellow, and green, kind of like a color block theme. It's got a weed leaf and then it's got like six or seven palm trees. It's super cute. Last thing on top are these cyclone hemp cones and these are in the flavor Wonderberry. One hemp cone and one wooden tip. Okay, so it's a wooden tip. The last one of the cyclones I smoked I was actually very pleasantly surprised by. So I kind of want to open it and see what it looks like with you guys. A little wooden tip on there. All right, onto the piece. It's big, so we're going to go with that it's a bong. Oh, it's beautiful. Here's what he looks like. The perk is white as well as a couple of like the accents and the mouthpiece. The base is white. It's super pretty. And then this is going to be the little bowl. Yes, how cute. I love its little grabber. Always break off the handle somehow, but I'm going to go give this a rinse and then 
we can take a couple rips. I'm back. The bong is clean. I'm going to give you guys a little shot of the function. All right, my bowl is packed. I'm going to go ahead and take a hit and see how it functions. Cheers again. Function's pretty good. I was able to take that as a snap. This bong's pretty nice because it's not huge, but it's not tiny either. So there is room for two perks. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, make sure to drop a like. If you're new here, make sure to subscribe. Also, like I mentioned earlier, my Instagram has been deactivated. So make sure to follow my backup. It's jblaze2.0. That is my account. And I hope to see you all in my next video. Peace. I love you. Stay safe. Bitch, move for a team. That bitch, move for a team.